Welcome to Cyber's Mobile Asset Management Demo. We're going to show you a demonstration of a mobile application which can be used to support engineers maintaining equipment, either in a factory setting or out in the field. The purpose of this demo is not just to showcase mobile technology. We're also going to present a strong business scenario to tell a story involving the mobile application. And in doing so, we'll demonstrate the way mobile applications can evolve in the enterprise. The picture in the centre of the circle shows a technical view of the scenario. The mobile application runs on the Apple iPad and is operated by the maintenance engineer. It is connected to the back-end system via the Sybase Unwired platform, which provides a connectivity suite to allow integration optimised for mobile applications. The back-end application itself is SAP with an enterprise asset management flavour. In the top left corner you can see the particular business scenario we are going to work with. Mobile maintenance in the steel mill. The application will support the work of engineers who maintain the equipment in the mill. We will be looking at the evolution of mobility in the steel mill in three stages, which are typical of the stages an enterprise goes through in its adoption of mobile technology. Each stage is associated with a particular business problem. The first stage is enablement. Here we are simply extending the functionality of the backend system, in this case SAP, out into the field. The business problem is an inefficient process where engineers must print out paper forms which they then fill out on the factory floor before coming back to the office to enter the data into the SAP system. We're not adding any new functionality at this stage, but we increase productivity simply by allowing the engineers to enter information directly into the system while they work via the mobile device. The second stage is the innovation stage. The business problem here is that there are large numbers of identical pieces of equipment in the mill and engineers sometimes get confused and maintain the wrong unit. We will show how the unique possibilities of the mobile platform will be used to create an innovative solution to this problem. The final stage is the collaboration stage. The business problem dealt with here is that when engineers notice in the course of their work that a piece of equipment is damaged or needs additional maintenance, it is taking too long to act on this information. We will show how mobile applications operating in concert can improve collaboration and cut down response time considerably. Now we see the business processes we will deal with in this scenario. There are three roles indicated by the dark purple chevrons. The first is a supervising engineer. There's a bit of jargon to take in at this point. For example, the concept of the notification in asset management. This is the message that is created by the maintenance engineers when they notice that a piece of equipment is damaged or needs additional maintenance. The supervising engineer is responsible for reviewing those notifications and deciding whether they merit further investigation. The next concept, the maintenance order, roughly equates to a job and is associated in our scenario with a piece of equipment which must be maintained. The maintenance operations are the individual tasks which must be completed in order to close out the maintenance order or job. The next role is the scheduler, who assigns the maintenance operations or tasks to work centres. The work centre dictates who the operation is assigned to. The scheduler checks everything and releases the maintenance order, which sends the operations out to the mobile devices based on work centre. The maintenance engineer is, is responsible for doing the work. They receive a list of operations on the mobile device and complete them. That is, they indicate that the task has been finished and enter in the actual time spent. Below, you can see the business problems listed. As already discussed, the inefficient paper-based process will be solved in the enablement phase. The equipment mix-up will be solved in the innovation phase and the slow response time to notifications will be solved in the collaboration phase. Now let's take a look at the application.